What's up YouTube? Just want to do a quick video. I posted a video early about uh, earlier about me boroscoping my cylinder heads. So uh, the uh, 76 Westie was running hot and I actually purchased a oil uh, temperature sender that just daisy chains into your uh, oil pressure gauge and after five ten minutes of driving it was hitting 200 and 230 degrees which is uh unacceptable for whatever reason the engine wasn't uh didn't seem as hot as it really was like this one right here when it had its a rat's nest in it it was overheating bad but anyways so just wanted to show you i used this uh boroscope tool that hooks up to your phone there's a uh, video of it on my channel you can see me using it so i put it in my spark plug holes on each uh, uh, tinware so I could look inside there see if there's any rat's nest and lo and behold there was a rat's nest in my uh, oil uh, cooler and here it is right here so that was perfectly laying on top of my oil cooler and was keeping every bit of cooling air from going through my oil cooler so all I did was just take this side piece of tin off my uh compartment seal distributor i mean it probably took an hour to get everything disassembled and then uh you're not really gonna be able to see it because that flap but the oil cooler is right under here and i could i was able to pry this up enough and stick my hand under and get it out and then i blew all blew all the uh, trash out with my air compressor and uh now i'm about to vacuum up the little pieces left but I just want to show you that in case you're uh, experiencing over temping and you've checked your thermostat and everything's hooked up, everything's sealed up, there's no hot air getting into the engine compartment and the oil's still getting too hot. Um, this was $15 on Amazon. It's a depth stick. Depth stick. I'm sure I'm mispronouncing that. But it just runs off of Bluetooth. They call it Wi-Fi on their website, but it's really just Bluetooth. And you sync it up to your phone. And it creates a picture on your phone so you can see exactly what this is seeing. So that's how I saw it really quickly. So I would just recommend getting one of these instead of, uh, you know, committing to pulling your engine because you can't figure it out. Especially if your Volkswagen Beetle or bus has been sitting for a number of years. Um, it doesn't look like, you know, as nice as it is, you wouldn't think that it had been sitting uh, for that long. But it had been. I just got it restored. Finally finished the restoration almost. Um, a few weeks ago, so I've just been getting it on the road. But anyways, that was my little uh, little tip. Just get you a little boroscope slash endoscope and uh, see for yourself before you pull the motor just out of sheer frustration.